don't drink this Kool-Aid. <laughs> Have you ever wondered if you can bleach a liquid? Let's find out. It worked. Have you ever read through the list of ingredients for a package of chips or shampoo and encountered unfamiliar chemical names? Silicon dioxide and salt? Trisodium phosphate and ferrous gluconate and cereal? phosphoric acid and soda, chemistry can help you better understand the chemicals you purchase. In this course, you will learn how to ask and answer questions about the chemistry of your everyday world. You'll be able to describe chemical phenomena from why your soda goes flat when you leave it open to how a warmer climate can make our oceans more acidic, both of which involve carbon dioxide gas. We will learn how atoms form elements and compounds and how these react and interact with each other why sodium reacts so violently with water, and how to calculate how much energy is released in this violent reaction. This class will allow you to practice basic science skills and to develop your scientific literacy, cultivating an interest in science that's gonna continue beyond this last assignment so that you're confident in making decisions on scientific issues, whether you're at the voting booth or at the checkout line. Many textbooks present the scientific method as a rigid and linear process, but once you dive into science, you'll see that this is rarely straightforward. Science is questions. Science is investigation and discovery and exploration. Science is taking risks. My name is Emily Falconer. Welcome to Chem 139.